What's up, y'all? I'm back, and today I'm going to do a story time video. Sorry if I keep looking over my nephew's sleep. But I gotta be loud because the audio on here is not that good. Sorry for the glare. I'm gonna try to do my head like this, but I'm like directly by the uh, light. I mean, by the window because, like, the lighting isn't so good because I just filmed this, which is annoying. I gotta redo it. But the lighting is better right here, so let's just get into this. It's gonna be about fake friends and bullying. So, I was in sixth grade. We was in sixth grade. So, um, I, I gotta remember to look at the camera, but I, um, I'm so lost. But she, it was like the third day of school, and like, technically, she was new, but yeah, because everybody was new, but like, you know, she was new because like, everybody done found out what their classes was. Didn't have to go through the time of trying to be scared in class because it's over with. But anyways, she was new. So, yeah, I just like to talk to new people and, like, just get to know them. So I was like, hey, you want to be my friend? You know, everybody do it. Don't try to act like you don't. When you was young, you try to write notes and stuff. Like, um, hey, you want to be my friend or something like that. But, yeah. I asked, she was like, yeah, and we had a good friendship for the couple of weeks or something, and then these boys and this girl, they was like, started making friends with her, and she started to like, go with them more, and like, be their friend, and start to just away from me, at first, we was all kind of cool, but I wasn't really cool with them, because I really didn't like them, but, you know, it was whatever, I just sat with them at lunch and stuff, but I just, um, liked hanging out with her so I just did it because like she was my friend but anyways she um started to not be my friend so I was like okay whatever I didn't I mean I only was her friend when nobody else was her friend like everybody was trying to talk about her and saying that she ugly and that they wanted to fight her and she just got there I don't understand but that was what she had going on but anyways, she, and I was like, I stepped in and was her friend. That's the only thing I did. I mean, what is that? But anyways, yeah, we weren't friends for a couple, for like a week or something. Yeah, we was like, okay, whatever. I'm like, you're not my friend. It's, I'm cool. But, because I don't really go, like, crazy over people like that because like that's your decision that's what you want to do it's whatever but she started to talk about me like personally she was talking i never told her anything so she couldn't really get no details but like personally as in of my appearance and like i really don't care because like nothing she said was true and like she had nothing on me but she um, was probably talking about me, her little crew click or whatever, was talking about me too. And I, of course, I said something back. It wasn't what a fifth grader should say, but I said it to her because I, I got to defend myself. So, anyways, yeah, so she started. So, yeah, that was going on for some time. And my other friends was like, don't worry about it because it was my real friends. And I knew them since, like, the elementary. And... Um, so she, we had to show into the bullying part. That was the fake friend part. So into the bullying part, we was had this pizza party in my class, and I was like not in the mood. I was so I was mad. I was sad. I forgot what was going on that day, but I just was not in the mood to be messed with. I was like, I didn't want to eat nothing. I didn't want to do nothing. But like, the teacher wanted somebody wanted us to eat, so I just ate. I mean, well, I got a piece a pizza, and then like. You know, I was thicker, and I am thicker, like, than most people, and, like, and I wasn't even that big, but, like, that's whatever. Like, you gotta be a twig to be fit in it. But anyways, like, they were trying to talk about me, talking about, oh, you can eat that food, you know you want to eat more than that, you know you be eating it all, while they was the main ones acting like they don't eat at home. Like, come on. They want to talk about somebody. Anyways... That's the same had to go on. But anyways, 
they was talking about me, whatever. I was like, okay, leave me alone. We ain't got nothing to do with each other. Like, I honestly didn't say nothing to them. I was sitting there quiet. Like, that's when you know somebody's been a real a-hole right there. And, like, they started talking about me, and I was just like, okay, shut up, leave me alone. You need to be quiet. Y'all the main ones eating something up, so get your life. Something right there. So, and I just turned my head and just, just didn't want to say nothing too far where I got sent out of the classroom. So, they was, um, kept going on. Like, they stopped and they kept going on. They were trying to, like, move me, move my chair, like, my desk, because it's, like, the connected desk. And, like, trying to be funny. And I was swear to I was, like, getting ready to just, whew, but I didn't want to do it. Because I was too sad or, like, mad or whatever. And then, they, like, I was just so mad. You don't know how mad I was. And, like, you know, when you be mad crying, that's what happened. And then, like, we started to clean up. And then, I was sitting down in my chair. I didn't get up because I was like doing the little knee, the little knee thing. <laughs> like everybody like don't 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 with their knee. That's what I was doing because I was so mad. And then, then they had, um, then like everybody was like, "What's wrong with you, Journey? What's ha- what's wrong? What y'all do for that girl?" Because um, it was people sitting that behind us that knew what was going on. So they was like, "Oh, um, they was talking about her, talking about she needs to eat her food and stuff." And then I was like, and I ain't say nothing. And then. Like, you know, when you just look and you just be, like, crying. So that's what I did. I was, like, it's like a mad cry. I wasn't crying, like, full-blown. <laughs> like that. I was crying, like, just, like, like a mad, like, like that. And then, then they was looking at me. And then the teacher had pulled me up and then went outside and I told them what happened. Told her what happened, who the people was, and... She had said, we never have a pizza party no more because of that situation. And then they um, told me to go clean myself up. So that was, like, I felt justice a little bit. But coming back was the most awkward situation because, like, I had to go back in class where everybody, it was quiet, most likely. I knew it was going to be quiet. And I was, like, trying to not come back to class because I was, like, so mad. And I was, it was so awkward. So I came in, everybody was looking at me. And she had them separated everybody. And then the girl was still in front of me who um, betrayed me and not with my friend no more. So she, I mean, like when the bell rang, she started getting her stuff. And a boy, she was walking. And she said, like, I feel bad. I feel bad now. And she tried to look back at me. And I, I rolled my eyes like, don't try to feel bad now because it is what it is. You did what you the end you got yours but yeah just don't bully people because it's not nice and like payback can happen and later on in the year she almost got a spell that was her payback to learn her lesson not to do bad stuff well it was in because of that but like it was like on in the year and um, we still go to the same school now and she's trying to be my friend talk to me i mean forgive and forget I mean, I could do that, but, like, I'm not going to talk to you. I'm really stubborn, but I don't, I don't hold grudges at the same time. But, anyways, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Sorry if it's long, but please watch this video because I had to redo this, like, legit four times or three or four times just to get the right lighting because I did it back there on my dresser, but it was, like, no lighting because I was so far from this light. Ooh, I should have did it like this, but... Then I did it in my mama room. It didn't work. Then I did it, like, right there twice. And then did it right here. And this is the best light I can get right here. So, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please like this video. And, um, there will be many more stories. So, yeah. Bye. Deuces. Love you.